கிரீட்டிங்ஸ் ஆஸ்பிரண்ட்ஸ் வெல்கம் டு அ ஸ்பெஷல் வீடியோஸ் நிப்பட் பை சங்கர் ஏஸ் அகாடமி சி இன் மை ப்ரிப்ரேஷன் ஜேர்னி ஐ ஹவ் மெட் அ லாட் ஆஃப் ஆஸ்பிரண்ட்ஸ் தர் ஆர் சம் ஆஸ்பிரண்ட்ஸ் ஹூ சோல் ஃபோக்கஸ் இஸ் ஆன் த யூபிஎஸ்சி சிவில் சர்வீசஸ் எக்ஸாமினேஷன்ஸ் தர் ஆர் சம் ஆஸ்பிரண்ட்ஸ் ஹூ ப்ரிப்பேர் ஃபார் யூபிஎஸ்சி சிவில் சர்வீசஸ் எக்ஸாமினேஷன்ஸ் அண்ட் ஆல்சோ ப்ரிப்பேர் ஃபார் த ஸ்டேட் பப்ளிக் சர்வீஸ் கமிஷன் எக்ஸாமினேஷன்ஸ் அண்ட் த பேங்க் எக்ஸாமினேஷன் அஸ் அ பேக்கப் தர் ஆர் சம் ஆஸ்பிரண்ட்ஸ் ஹூ ட்ரை டு பேலன்ஸ் பிட்வீன் their work and their examination preparations and finally there are some aspirants whose sole focus is on the examinations conducted by the state public service commission these aspirants they have a doubt the doubt is that whether they would be able to study and clear upsc civil services examinations so today as a part of cracking the upsc the right way series by shankar as academy we are going to focus on that doubt the doubt being whether candidates who are solely preparing for the state public service commission examination would be able to study and clear upsc examinations there are 28 states in india each state having its own public service commission if i try to address everything this video will become very lengthy so i am going to limit myself to the candidates who prepare only for the tnpsc examinations see in tnpsc also the commission conducts lot of examinations in this video i am going to try to limit myself only to the group 1 examinations conducted by tamil nadu public service commission first let us take the preliminary stage see there is a general myth that tnpsc focuses only on the fact based question and upsc focuses on the analysis based question see this is just a myth if you take the group 1 preliminary examinations that are conducted post 2019 you can easily find that the pattern of examinations are evolving tnpsc it has started moving towards upsc pattern there are more concept based and more analysis based question so in the preparation aspect that is the mode of preparation you don't need to change anything the only change you have to make is what to study take history for example for tnpsc you will be focusing more on the tamil nadu history aspect in case of upsc you have to focus more on the national issues and take science for example in science tnpsc focuses more on the core sciences but in case of upsc you have to focus more on the science and technology aspect and in case of current affairs also most of the current affairs asked in the tnpsc examinations are limited to tamil nadu but in case of upsc you have to cover the na- you have to cover all the national issues okay so in essence you don't need to change the way or the mode you prepare but you have to change what you prepare so you have to read little widely for clearing upsc examinations so coming to the question is it tough for a tnpsc candidate to clear upsc examinations no not at all if you work diligently and if you are able to do a little bit of extra reading you can easily clear upsc civil service examination in the prelim stage now moving on to the main stage in main stage also tnpsc post 2019 has started asking analysis based question if you are not believing me see this question and judge yourself see in the first question they are asking us to examine whether rural women are empowered by the panchayati raj institutions and in the second question they are asking us to critically evaluate the role of e learning platforms in addressing the rural urban divide see even in static parts like history also tnpsc has started asking more analysis based question see this question they are asking us to assess the working of diarchy in the provinces after the government of india act 1919 and in the second question they are asking us to justify that vellur mutiny is a precursor to the first war of independence see all these questions are analysis based questions so post 2019 in the mains tnpsc is asking only analysis based questions so in essence if you have diligently prepared for tnpsc mains examination you will be able to address three general studies papers of UPSC civil services mains examinations 
if you have little bit of writing practice you can easily manage the essay paper also only place where you need extra work is in the ethics paper and in the optional paper now coming back to the question is it tough for a tnpsc candidate to crack upsc examinations see for this question in my opinion if you put your heart and soul into it and if you are ready to do a little bit of extra reading i am sure you will be easily able to crack upsc civil services examination i hope this session was useful until we meet in the next session signing off balaji